I don't know. They don't want us to be live. Ma'am? Cups. Let me put some trip. Where's my wavy? I didn't buy no more things. You didn't buy no more what? Cups. Cups. Why? I didn't. I you got them in here? Huh? You got a pile of them somewhere. I don't know. You do? Well, Some, I don't use it anymore out here. I just clean them for the ride. Mm -hmm. I think I'll we'll bring my can with me this time. Can cover? You don't have to worry about it. Potatoes. Potatoes? Oh. Raton potatoes. What? Well, we got six on here. It's been on five minutes. Somebody needs to call Facebook and punch them in the throat. Huh. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Amber. Amber's the first one on here, mate. Hey, Miss Amber. The second go around. We was on a minute ago and it quit. We really don't know what happened. Kind of peel some potatoes. But we've been uh, over at Lorraine's house. Chris is trying to get the pressure washer. And, uh, and all these brand new blackstone to cook on. Who said that? Hey, Miss Tana, where'd my bacon go, babe? Well, I left in the truck. Oh, yeah. Miss Tana, thank you so much. I finally put my hands on it today. Yeah, Lorraine's had it. Lorraine's been having it. Had it in her pocket. Well, we'd have had it in West Virginia. We'd have we'd probably ate it, it, yeah. But to tell you what we're going to do, we're going to eat it up in the mountains because we got a trip planned in October, I think. Yes. We're going to be somewhere. Yes, yeah, October. And uh, after we catch we them gators this it. year. Huh? Share it. Baron Gan, how you doing? Do what, babe? We'll share it. You will share it? Yeah. We always share it, babe. Supposed to share. Yep. Y'all, we got these little bit of pork chops. They're going to be so good. Linda Campbell, how you doing? Billy All Salt, how you doing? From Tennessee. Remember when we went years without eating them? What? Little ones like that. What? Pork chops. What you talking about? No, I don't remember that. Yeah. We just got the regular pork chops. Mm. We used to get the little ones, y'all, one time. <laughs> one of my nephews is over here. I ain't going to say who he is or was. Was. <laughs> but in which way, we had these little center-cut pork chops, okay? And uh, we was cooking them. And, uh, well, a couple of days before that, we were skinning gerbils. Everybody gonna say you were skinning gerbils? Tell them, baby, I'm not lying. <laughs> not lying. We were skinning gerbils. Skinning gerbils. We had a, a hey, Miss Tana, sharing the bacon is a good thing. Yes, it is. We are. Uh, we were uh, skinning gerbils. I know that sounds funny, but uh, they would send about 500 gerbils every year for us to skin, uh, and. Um, Anyway, we would skin them, and uh, you take the fur off of the, the, the gerbils, and what you do with the fur, you just would bag it up, vacuum pack it, and freeze it, and then we'd send it to this this company, which would uh, which would take take the uh, the fur, grind it up, cook it down somehow or another, and then we would make serum that for people that was allergic to fur and stuff like that. That's what they did with that. And uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. But we used to skin gerbils. <laughs> so anyway, we were skinning them gerbils and they come in and looked at them and seen them, the kids did. So a couple days later, they was over here eating and we had these little pork chops, the center cut, little pretty pork chops like that. We had some of them and uh, <coughs> we had some of them and we uh fried them up and uh kids asked what that was i said that's gerbils <laughs> uh, and uh hey they kept on eating them <laughs> yeah. yeah they uh they was eating i said y'all want another gerbil and they said that's gerbils i said yeah y'all seen us skinning them 
They said, yeah, we want one that good. <laughs> I had y'all, we were fixing to uh, put these taters in cooking. Got a couple of oddball taters in here. Let me get a spoon. I want to show y'all how much um, stuff we're going to put in here. Now, I got that crab ball right here. And uh, we're fixing to boil these potatoes. And uh, well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to run some hot water first. Huh? I'm sure you're going to kill us. Huh? I'm sure you're going to kill us what you're going to do. Yeah. So you left one little potato in there. You want it? No. We ain't going to eat them anyway. I got too many. If I get them, I'm going to eat them. <laughs> no, no. All right, y'all. Hey, Linda Stout. How you doing? Oh, we. Who said that? Rhonda Brooklyn. How you doing, Mike Hughes? What's up? They need to get a Facebook fix. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Josh Stafford. How you doing? Ash Walker. How you doing? Yeah, the pollen is bad down here. Super bad. Um. One day you got like an inch of pollen on everything. Angel, Angela, oh, where'd Angela go? Josh Shepard, how you doing? What's up, Bruce? Uh, Angela, come on now. Oh, it went again. Angela, bar, bait, beta, how you doing? Getting ready for the seven to ten inches of rain over the next three, four days, Cleveland, Mississippi. Ooh. We don't need that rain. All right, y'all. Hey, let me step. What are you doing, woman? I'm She'd be looking at my stuff, y'all. Come over here. We're going to show y'all. Take it somewhere you look. Huh? You can it. Ed, the um, Ed down, look. Did you see that? Yeah. I didn't see that. They usually don't have that though, don't they? I know that, Alright, y'all. We got this all worked out. I think. And, uh, who said that? Hey, Linda. Thank you, come. There we go. Alright, y'all. Now, this is crab oil. This is Adirondack crab oil. And y'all see me put this in these potatoes. Well, let me show y'all something. If you do that, it gives it a great flavor. I'm putting about a spoonful. Y'all don't even do that. Do a half a spoonful. Yeah, it's going to be hot. Too. This stuff is potent. Sure as I tell you, it is potent. And we're going to uh, put a little more water in here. Put a little more water in here and get over here and start cooking these taters. No. Then we get the fire on. Water's gonna get hot. We're gonna eat just some potatoes. Hey, Mr. Otis, how you doing? Chris Wade, how you doing? Hey, Mr. Albert Huggins, how you doing tonight? All right, y'all, y'all watch this. I gotta move my little. This thing folds up, y'all. I love it. Watch this. Maybe you take for somebody, somebody said something the other day about uh. Right. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Somebody just said something about the, the uh, pollen. Watch this. Watch this, y'all. Y'all hang on. I'm kidding. See this? Y'all was talking about the pollen while ago. Watch this. That much. That much pollen. We dusted this off the other day. I can't stand all this stuff on here. That's why I'm working on the pressure washer. Alright, we're going to set this over here. Try to wipe it down a little bit. Get some of this old dust off of it anyway. Old pollen, I mean. It is everywhere. Hey, that's part of the part of Louisiana life. Spring. Spring time. Just hand my, my, my boat. Mm -hmm. 
Ma'am? The plants in the boat. Oh. They're coming up pretty good. We'll fix the water. Look like the water's squirting on this side. Uh, we're going to go ahead and light these up, y'all. Let this get hot because I'm going to have to clean it because I left it open. Set the mosquitoes on it. Whenever you leave one of these open, them bugs get on it. Plus, we're going to light this. Huh? Can you get over there? We could cook some of them pork chops in there. Andy Griffin, how you doing? I'm grilling what? We're there. Hey, Karen, hey, man, how you doing? Mr. Otis, don't be doing overdoing it now. <laughs> he said he tried to mow the yard. Albert Huggins, how you doing? Karen, hey, man, how you doing? What did you spray? That's like a um, spick and span. Spick and sand. Ricky Henderson's in the house. Hey, Ricky. They ain't green up here in Kentucky. Yep, we passed through Kentucky last week or two ago. A little bit of it. Probably be heading up there not this week, but the next week. Here's Andy Griffin back again. How you doing? I'm grilling right now, but for the whole week, we going to have to. Ooh. Randy Hogan, how you doing? Vernon East, what's up? Nancy DeBees, how you doing? Jeff DeVoe. Burning did it, y'all. All right, y'all. We're going to get a little bowl. We'll try to, and we're going to start cooking these old pumpkin chops. We got milk, babe? Cups so you can get very yeah. Yes. Well. Yes. Yes. And yes again. We got enough bread and pork, we'll do it. Hey Nancy to be Jeff DeVoe, how you doing? Get a price, what's up? Keep price. I can just heat one up for yeah. a salad or something. We're keep cut. Keep price, how you doing? Bernie, save me a bite. Come on and get it. Albert Huggins, how you doing? Hey Mr. Otis. Mike Hughes. Uh John Kelly, how you doing? Wendy Sue Hammond, how you doing today? Jacob Pete's in the house. What's up, Jacob? Okay, y'all got the air fryer buzzing. Wait, well, don't miss in it. I don't think I'm gonna run in there. We went to Lorraine, got the pressure washer. Couldn't get hers working. I got two pressure washers over here. We both ordered, well, we ordered parts for them. They ain't come in. And, uh, any which way, we are waiting. Uh, Jim Cole, what's that, Bruce? You ever, uh, fry up? Your potato skins? Oh yeah. Depends what I'm I'm cooking them and stuff. Who said that? Alan Long said, when we going kayaking. That's it. I wouldn't even know how to get in the kayak no more. So aggravated with that. We just got so busy, I told Janet, when I get back from filming these snake show, yet I don't care if stuff gets around. You gotta hire somebody because I'm gonna be busy. I got stuff I wanna do. And uh I'm I'm gonna be too busy to be doing all this other stuff. All right, y'all, let me go get the scraper and clean some of these bugs off of here. I'll get the bugs a little, a little cleaning. Get it hot. Some of these bugs off. Leave a few of them. Right. Let me 
do. And we're going to steam it up. Well, we used to cook them potatoes every day on this. We ain't done that in a while, have we? Nope. Got them all cleaned up now, y'all. Cook them all. I don't even know why I left this because we cooking on the... Oh yeah, we got some green beans to cook, huh? You doing anything special, Mama? Okay. Y'all come on over here, we're gonna dump. Go get these eggs. Hey, Alan Long, how you doing? What? Okay. You can go in and get us a pen if you want. What? Yes, ma'am. Hey, Alan Long. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know read that. Linda Style, how you doing? All right, y'all, we're going uh, to we'll broke a couple of these eggs in here. Poke them in the eye, mix that up a little bit. Dump a little bit of milk in here. That should be done up. Mm -hmm. Seasoning cook. Thank you, man. I bet you can find them. Can open Yeah. I got one in my wallet if I can't. Who said that? Linda Stout, how you doing? Uh, Mike Hano's in the house. What's up, Mike? Hey, Michael. I'm on my way. Good. You get my fresh water working. <laughs> Come on. I'll put you to work, Mike. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. You got that happening? We're going to open up this, y'all. This is some good stuff. This. Hang on. Let me read what old Craig had to say. Craig Metz, what's up? You need to stay home long enough to get ready for snake and gator season. Bad hurricane season. Ah. Yeah. No, they said I need to hurry up because uh, it's almost hurricane season. Oh yeah. So this is the um, this is the uh, Louisiana air fryer mix. Miss Jenny said it. It is good. I got a mosquito on me. Okay, baby, I don't see the um. What? I don't see the uh. Can opener? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I do. Can we buy one on the road? I don't know. I got to bring a drink. I need to do that. All right, y'all. Hey, Kathy Smith. How you doing? Where'd Kathy go? Going to cook some good food? Oh, yeah. Jack and Pete, what's up? We had poor man's lasagna tonight. Oh, we. I like my lasagna. Yeah, I need to make that one. But this stuff is really good in that air fryer. Make sure I got it up. Hey, can I feel this thing, Paul? What? No. Why? If you can get them all away, once you start, you're going to do them all. They got to come off, Bruce. They got to. Yeah, all right, y'all, we're going to throw these pork chops in here. In this stuff. Just in so they're playing with stuff. She shouldn't be, but that's all right. We're gonna let her do it. She's playing with the stickers, y'all. I'm just taking them off. All right, y'all, come on over here. Yeah, that's Miss Janet making all that noise, y'all. <laughs> Who said that? Lanny and Art, how you doing? Sheila Cox, how you doing? Greg Hammond, how you doing? Hello. Oh, my do a, how you doing? What? I wouldn't be doing if I had something to eat. Yeah. We're going to spray this up. Uh, we're going to spray this up. Spray that down pretty good, y'all. Got some on over here. All right, woman, you about to get on my nerves with all that noise. <laughs> we're gonna take the pork chop out of here, y'all. Out of the uh, 
coat it real good. Look at that. Look at there. We're going to set it in that pan. Then we're going to do it another time. Another time? Let it drain down. Now I got that egg washer. The egg washer is just egg, a couple eggs, and some milk. Table off. What do you want me to do with all that stuff from putting that pizza oven together? Whatever you want. Can I put on this table right here? I don't care. You better care. Yeah, that'd be good, man. <laughs> Can't you see I'm busy? Okay, y'all. Ready to eat? Clear table off. Hurry. That's what he's gonna do, y'all. Y'all know he's like a book. Y'all, she's fixing to go somewhere and eat. I ain't yeah. letter eating on this. I'm gonna go beat my daughter for dinner. Ah! Huh? Okay, y'all, we're gonna throw these other ones <laughs> in here. Y'all pay that woman no attention over there. <laughs> Let these be soaking a minute. Okay, y'all, we're gonna take this. This run here, look at them. That pretty what? We'll go ahead and stick them over here. Bring the other one over here. Shake them up good, y'all. Shake your bacon. Remember the shake and bake? Yeah, you shake your bacon, Got one down. Two more to go. This is the, uh, for the air fryer, this is just super good, y'all. Jenny's sister showed us this a couple weeks ago. Jennifer, uh, Cassidy's mom. It is definitely a good one, huh, baby? Mm-hmm. Yes. And yes, again. I need to learn how to make this one. Well, what happens if you double dip? Mm. Nothing. It all falls apart, y'all. Don't waste your time double dipping on this, y'all. Mm -hmm. Put that over here. Put that down right there. Now come on over here. We're gonna throw this. This other air fryer. Thanks to Blackstone, they sending me all this new stuff. You know, fix start working on. And uh Blackstone makes a can of it. <laughs> hey, hey. Yeah. yeah. I know y'all what y'all thinking, what would Blackstone make a can opener for? But did I show y'all the coffee maker they made? That's pretty cool. It's up in that camper somewhere. Y'all what I'm doing. Hey Bill Davis. I said that. Joey Payne, how you doing? What's up? How long uh, you got to cook them in the air fryer? I don't know. I don't never time nothing. I just go look at it once in a while. But I need to. Uh, um, what time is it? I just put them in. I'm going to tell you in a little bit. It's 645. Oh, hmm? Just Janet shining all my new stuff up, y'all. I'm gonna rag them. Duck crawfish king, what's up? I am Ro. How you doing? Looks like a good night down there for catfishing. Yes, and boy, they've been catching some too. Rodney's son went out and caught a bunch of them. I just ain't got. Huh? He's almost ready. Got socks on. What you talking about? Potatoes. Oh. No, I'm going to get them in a minute. Just cut them off. Okay? Yep. Y'all, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and open these. I got my Gerber knife always carry with me. The pliers. And it's got a can opener on them. Pour these cans. Mint up. Have you threw it out there and clean it? Yeah. That's what we got to do after we eat. Yes, ma'am.
We got a can opener in there somewhere. Every time we go to Houston, Stone, didn't we buy one? Yep. On the road? I think Miss Shirley brought us one and sent it to us. One more. That red one, it's somewhere up in there. Or... I don't know. I might have packed it and brought it up front or something, huh? Believe it or not, y'all, I think I got a, uh, a P90 in my back pocket. Y'all know what a P90 I think it's a P90, ain't it? Y'all gonna think I'm crazy, but let me see. They, are, they probably know that, don't they? Randy Kelly, how you doing? Oh, Bill Davis, I don't know what happened, but we saw her for your loss. Linda Carter, how you doing? Y'all hang on. I sprayed it. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm curious. I'm looking in my wallet. Yep. Uh-oh. I do. That, that is a can opener right there, y'all. Been in my wallet for years and years, my mama. Yep, I got one in my wallet. Mm-hmm. Janet got one, y'all. She's going to be carrying it for like four years. Yep. Oh, we used to have an army surplus store down the road across the interstate. Gone now, but. Hi, right, y'all. Come on over here. We're going. Let me go get my. Uh... You took my dove, buddy? Huh? Yeah. What are we showing with Blackstone Sentinel? Blackstone Sentinel, these, uh. It's the infrared thermometer. I could shoot my pizza oven with it, which is pretty good. And this one, it's pretty neat because you can shoot 90 degrees, baby. You can shoot, I'm shooting this chin in the mouth. <laughs> you know. We doing this whole thing just for green beans? Yeah, I guess we are. Then you got your rod you can stick and you poke chops with it and see what the temperature is like. So we're going to do that in a minute. Hey, we're going to use this one. It's clean. What? This. I don't got that in hot. It don't matter. I'm good with it. You can just do a... I know she keeps it. interrupting you. I don't know what we're going to do with her. Sandy Zingler, how you doing? Randy Kelly, how you doing? Hey, you too. Hey, you never stop talking. Cole, uh, pull up. <laughs> how you doing? Pretty sticky in <laughs> here. You said that. John Kelly was a can opener to the John Wayne, yeah. Baby, tell them I'm surprised. What's our surprise? What? Oh! Yeah, I've kind of told them a little bit. Yeah, the, um, things just, I just proved them. The things, Miss Jenner, Miss is telling y'all about the hats. We're fixing to get hats. Not these kind of hats. Regular hats we're getting made as we speak. Uh, we don't know when it's going to come out. They're going to send us some. We're going to show y'all what we got and where you can get them from. And we're getting shirts. I'm really excited about the shirts. And they're going to be high quality, good shirts. Really good. Tammy Boatman, how you doing? Charlie Chuck, how you doing? Hey, Miss Vicki Moore, how you doing? Scott Bell, there he is. How's brother? Brother uh, has been gone, uh, Scott. Huh? Well, I don't know. It's been four months, huh? Sure, but I'm trying to Where'd you go, Scott? Scott, I tried to answer you, Scott, on the uh, Facebook, and uh, I'm having issues with everything Facebook. But no, uh, the uh, brother had a stroke, and we uh, took care of him for a couple of weeks, and he just uh, didn't make it. Uh, we brought him to the vet to see what they could do about it, and uh, there was nothing. Uh, they said no matter what, he wouldn't make it. 187. So we had to put brother down. Uh, brother was an outside cat. And we knew it was an outside cat. And we asked the, uh, the, the vet what could we do because uh, 
because we just didn't want him to suffer, but we uh, wanted to know if he can ever go back outside. They said, no, never. And he kept fighting us, wanting to go outside every day. And uh, just couldn't do it. Y'all, we're going to throw a little bit of this uh, sesame oil on here. And we're going to cook these beans and do something a little different. Just a little bit. You don't want a lot. regular oil there and then we're gonna throw a little bit of this right on top of it. That uh what do I do with it? Well I can't find nothing all right we're gonna spread this a little bit y'all you know what I better do? Go ahead and light it huh I look every time. We'll go ahead and dump these on here. All right, y'all. Who said that? Hey, Ricky Henderson. How you doing? Chill Cox. Bigger size and shirts, please. Yes, he said he can make some. What size, babe? They're going to have 2X and 3X. We ain't, I ain't got that for you. I will talk we ain't got that, that far yet, Jen said. But I heard him talk, say something about 2X, yeah, I'll 3X. Take, I'll take but uh, we're going to have all kind of size shirts coming. And uh, I'm going to let y'all uh, know when it's time. And you can go to that web page and order them. Come back. Yeah. Ponce Leon, how you doing? From Philadelphia. Ricky Henderson, what's up? It's been a while since we've uh, got to watch you cook. At night. Yes. Yes. That's why I'm kind of kicking back, slowing down, trying to do that. Uh, Alexander D. Cummins. How you doing? The P38. Yep. Can't open it. Yep. Let me see the peak. How you doing? Yep. Uh, I had one when I was a kid. My uncle gave me. And uh, I carried that thing all over the country. And uh, kept it in my pocket and my wallet. I had it on the key. A, like a necklace at one time. Old P38 can opener. Hey, Miss Shirley Chuck. What's for supper? It was late. Well, Miss Shirley. Uh, well, I think I was going to start giving the merits and stuff for being late, but the Facebook's not sending out the sending it out, you know, so I can't really do that. What? Yeah. People are not getting notifications, and I don't know what to do about it, you know. But any which way, Miss Shirley, we're cooking some pork chops in the air fryer. We have the, I was going to show you, air fryer from Louisiana, uh, chick, uh, Louisiana. Uh, it's uh, chicken fry or pork, pork chop fry. Miss Jen, it would work. There we go. It's an air fryer seasoning coating. Now, I already got seasoning on them. And uh, it's an air fryer seasoning from Louisiana. And it is delicious. Hey Terry Smart, how you doing? Aaron Jarrett, how you doing? I'm doing good. Terry Williams, what's up Terry? Been a while, what's up Ruth? We doing pretty good. Darlene Dickerson, how you doing? She'll love to have me some of them cookers. They nice. Uh, Blackstone's fixing to come and film a bunch of stuff for uh, next Monday, I think they're going to be here. They're going to be here Sunday, but Hopefully Monday they'll be here and we could uh I'm gonna just set up my camera and do some live and let y'all see us working. John Kelly said three X shirts, I'm sure we're gonna have them. I think what we're gonna do first, he might have an order and then we can just order what you want and pre order and uh any which way uh do a pre-order deal. You might do that. It's the same same shirt we used to get years ago. 
from Club Red, and uh, Jeff Foxworthy and his brother owns owns the company, and they had went down, shut it down, and uh, then they opened it back up, and a good friend we met years ago is opening it, so so we all excited about it. Let me go poke them. Hey Rose Jarvis, how you doing? Scott A, what's up? I want one. <laughs> Yeah, we we gonna get them. Hey, Miss Chili Peck said uh, fried shrimp, mashed potatoes, roasted Brussels sprouts. Ooh, well, you can leave the Brussels, Brussels sprouts, sprouts out, but I eat the rest of it. Give me some Brussels Duck crawfish king, what's up? Looking forward to the shirts and hats. Billy Chrome, what's up? Ensley's made 15 months today. Really, Ensley's 15 months. Okay, y'all come on over here. We're gonna poke that poke shop. Y'all have a poke to Billy Chrome, what's up? Hey, what's that? Crone, Kenneth Crone and yeah. Keith Crone. Yeah. We went to school with uh, Kenneth Crone and Keith Crone. Last I seen, uh, Kenneth was in somewhere in California, I think. Last I seen. Betty Cook, how you doing? Kenneth says, show us the progress on your outdoor kitchen. No. <laughs> it ain't much. It just ain't much. Uh, I guess we do got a little bit. I got most of it wired. I got a lot of the insulation put up. Okay, y'all, we're gonna turn this on right here. Uh, what's poke top supposed to be? About 130, 140? The temperature of a cooked pork chop. That's 95 there. Okay, y'all. Let me cut it off. Put it back on. Yeah. I'm stuck this one. Hey, baby. 107. I'm going to show you later. I can't. What you got? Ah, Jensen went to the museum, took the baby today. Hey, Miss Karen Avant. Hey, she's walking Miss around Jensen. Huh? She's walking around Jensen. Okay. Ah, then you made me miss Miss Karen. David Hollingsworth, how you doing? I'll get a man. Doing the dang, how you doing? What you cooking? Some poke chops. Joe Owens, what's up? Will you put some red fish on black stone? Yes. A couple weeks we're gonna do that. I'm gonna I might do that next day or two. I don't know, put some on there. Dennis Wren, how you doing? Joe Owens. Oh yeah. Let's read that one. Shirley Chuck, how you doing? Hey Mr. Sprig Hudson, how you doing? You late? <laughs> And a lot of people's not getting notifications. Hey, Tammy Bolton, how you doing? <laughs> this is it. Norzo, how you doing? I'll wash your time before the sun goes down. Cool. You can come wash my truck. He said that. James Puller, what's up? James Fagan, how you doing? Jeffrey Brooks, how you doing from Iowa? Uh, Leon, how you doing? Hey, Bruce. What you do, uh, what you owe grills? Did you give them away or sold them? No, I give them away. I don't never sell no grills. I don't never sell no grills. Uh, anything any of these companies give me, I won't sell it. I don't sell it. I give it away. Um, a lot of time, I get, a lot of the old people I give them to and just different ones get, get the griddles, you know. Uh, yeah, southern law, brother laws, uh, yeah, and uh, because they, they're still good, there's nothing wrong with them, they just use and they want me to have the shiny stuff, which I don't care, you know. I got some of the first griddles they ever give me up front, and uh, actually, I just give them away because I, I, I won't be using them, you know, they want me to use the newer stuff. Doretta Garrett, how you doing? 145 on the pork chops. That's what I thought. One, I was thinking 135. 145 would be good. 
Kevin Stacy, how you doing? Ricky Henderson, what's up? Clouds rolling in. Mike Stanley, how you doing? Oh, down Roberts, how you doing from Michigan? Uh, Ginger said, are you coming to Hillbilly Days? No, not that I know of. Unless something really changes, no. I, I'm going to miss it, too. John Forrest, how you doing? Timmy K, how you doing from Alabama? Jack and Pete, what's up? Yep, Facebook is being weird. Okay, y'all, we're going to turn these down. Check these old pork chops again. Kevin uh, Oakman, how you doing? Uh, he said it's National Beer Day. No, I wish I was going to Pikeville and uh, to Hillbilly Days, but it don't look like we're going to do it. Tammy Kay, how you doing from Al uh, from Alabama? Hey, Miss Tanner Thornton, how you doing? The eclipse is almost directly over Kid Run. Oh, I a lot of people. Cool, cool. I guess Layman's is busy and some of them, uh, Amos, uh, what's the Amos, uh, uh restaurant you like to go to in Kid Rock? Uh, they offered it, we didn't offer it. It's in the office. Yep, well, let me cut this off, cut it back on. We're going to stuff this one. We're looking at 172 on that one. 140. I don't know what the heck. Mm -hmm. Let's flip them over. You look like we got a good tempo on them. Y'all want to get them on the Come back in here for a few more minutes, y'all. Let's stick these while we're here. One party. One twenty-seven. All right, y'all. I'm gonna flip these. He's back in here for a few minutes. Peter's about done. Move this over here so we get wet. Butter, 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 butter makes it better, baby. Y'all come on over here. We get this pot of potato. Drain the water off here. No, okay, there's mice too. Yeah, we kind of laid back tonight. Going to be cooking. Taking our time. Jimmy Brasher, Jeffrey Brasher, how you doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I bet. I bet Kid Ron's getting it right now with all them people. Kevin Osman, how you doing? We don't drink beer, Kevin. That's my this phone doing all the noise, baby. It's just all kind of stuff going off. I don't know how I look later. Who said that? Cole Pollock said, hey Bruce, we're waiting on the pizza dough. Yes. Well, I've talked to Blackstone about it. They said wait a little while longer. All right, y'all, we're going to chop this up a little bit. 
Hey, you tell it? Huh? The pizza recipe. The pizza dough. I think I can just go ahead and give it to everybody, huh? We're going to do pizza one day this week and I'll give you all the recipe. Hey, y'all, we got that all done. Kind of mashed. I'm going to cut some butter up right here. Drop a little butter in here and then we'll be ready to eat. I'm going to cut some thin pieces of butter. Mm-mm. Should have been the fire tonight, y'all. Mm hmm? All right, y'all. Mash this butter on up in here. We actually ready to eat. Y'all waiting on Miss Jenner as usual. Waiting on me for I don't know, maybe it's between breakfast and something. It's right there. Right here. Mm -hmm. Alright, y'all, we got our taters and green beans. Get your plate, mama. Come on. Let me share the chuck. I'm coming. Bill Davis, what's up? That's a what? Classic Smasher. Yeah, and we've been having that one a long time. Mm. Bill Davis, oh, Ricky Henderson, what's up? Mashed potatoes are better than cream potatoes. I like them all. Hang on, y'all. Trying to figure out what we need to get these chopped up, huh? Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Come on, Ma. No, you can turn. Come on, buddy. Well, I'm going to cut this off and just let them sit. There you go. I can take these out and sit you one right up there. You want it in your plate? Too, you think they hot. Are they gonna be hot, maybe? Maybe. What? They're gonna be hot? Yeah. They are? Yeah. Let me just take a little bit. Mm -hmm. Alright, you got that down. Mix up some of this. Get the butter going in. Throw this in the sink, y'all. I'll bet wash it off a little bit. Yeah, just run water in it. Ma'am? I said just run some water in it. Be mm -hmm. good. Let me get me a phone right here and get some. We've got some. a case of your drinks in the trailer and mm -hmm. inside. So we'll put some in here and we'll take some with us. I'm going to get some knees. We're going to sit over there, sit down and talk. And eat. I'm going to do it, don't I? I don't mm -hmm. think I need no dip sauce with this. Do I, babe? I don't think I need no dip sauce. Mm-mm, girl. I forgot my chair, y'all. You know? Get my phone in the rain to straighten up. She forgot to get our ticket, too. We have to get back with her. Hi, y'all. Hey, Miss Pat. How you doing? Pat Costner's in the house. Miss Little Cops. Why won't it go, y'all? Who said that? Thomas Lucas, what's up? You want me to put your tummy? Yes, indeed. Y'all got to take me a bite. Thomas Lucas, how you doing? I like these better the other way. What? The other way where you put them on the thing and put Worcester sauce and stuff on them mm -hmm. and then you cover them up for a while. Yeah. Because when they thick like this, mm -hmm. you can't, it's too much meat you can't really taste them. Yeah. You cover them half. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. They're good. 
They are delicious. Mm-hmm. Mm. Maybe I didn't doubt you. You didn't? Huh? I didn't think you would. Now we're going to hit this up with a little, little of that southern ball of seasoning on my taters. Make them melt right now. Y'all, yeah, I got to empty my mosquito trap. Oh, cool. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding, I got to give you some of that clucking sauce. This is fries. <coughs> what? Sweet fries. Oh. <coughs> it's about all the same, but I just tried to. Y'all, I'm cutting this with a book, uh, a plastic knife. Might as well say a bird knife. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. It's so tender and so good. Supply, don't, don't start. Huh? Supply. Yeah. Do Sandy Harp, it? how you doing? Steve Hanley, how you doing? We had uh, hamburger steak, onions, and gravy. Sounds good to me. Hey, I that one. Pam Martin, how you doing? St. Martin, how you doing? What did you put on the chops? You know, we didn't have that one time. Yeah, I know. Uh, we put uh, Louisiana air fry uh, pork chop mix on here. It's made for air fryer. Mm. You can buy them at Walmart or Wind Dicks here or wherever. Cane. No, Walmart ain't ain't got it. I ain't found it or come to Walmart. I don't know why. I think we bought that at Cane's, y'all. So y'all come over to Cane's and get you some. Yep, next time we go, I gotta get a couple boxes. Yep. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Hey, Miss Karen. Cut your hair. Look good. No, she just washed it. <laughs> you didn't cut your hair, did you? No, I just washed it and dried it straight today. Yeah. Down the pork chops is super good. Mm -mm. There's old Miller Marks in here. What's up? <clears throat> Hey, mister. Mm-mm. Y'all look so good. This is the brand new. And y'all know I can't keep secrets. <laughs> yeah. I think Brandon, don't call him yet, but it ain't going to be long. Yep. Brandon, if you don't want to tell people stuff, don't tell Bruce. Because he will tell everybody stuff. He can't keep a secret. No, but this is a good secret, y'all. <laughs> So you tell him Probably September or after, maybe. Uh, Brandon's going to start shipping seafood. Is he still thinking about it, or he is for sure? No, he's doing it. And uh, it's going to be a good thing. It's going to be a good mm -hmm. thing. The thing about it, when Brandon sends you something, you know it's going to be good. Uh, shrimp. Ugh. Oh yeah, he gets, he gets uh, maybe ships some shrimp, alligator, crawfish, crawfish. They'll be endless. And this shrimp's good. Hmm. He's always got good shrimp. Mm -hmm. And uh, no, we can't. I can't wait because God know we get hundreds of calls a week. What time's it close to cooking? I'm gonna go out and eat one day. I don't know, man. Mmm. 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 I used to go over there a few years ago when Mr. Elmer was alive and go over there. Elmer Cross was alive and they'd be eating biscuits over there in the morning. Uh. Elmer Cross? Mm hmm. To tell y'all what kind of man Janet's daddy was, the banker was Elmer Cross back in the day. 
Mm-hmm. Don't you think my favorite banker? You know. Her daddy would go up there and say, uh, I need fifty thousand dollars. He said, Okay. He said, How you want it? He said, It don't matter. Hundreds and fifties, it don't matter. <laughs> Hundreds and fifties. You know. A few minutes later, they come around with a little bag and give her daddy fifty thousand. Um, the banker would ask Mr. Amber would say, "Hey, you want you want to uh, fill out paper now or what?" He said, "No, I ain't got time today. I'll come back in a couple of days to fill out the paperwork." And uh, I don't believe you can go up in the bank and do that nowadays, huh? That was long time ago. Mm-hmm. Yep, you can't do that these days. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Who said that, y'all? She little cops, how you doing? Yeah, I got to have me another one. Ricky uh, Henderson, how you doing? That speaks volumes, yes? Her daddy was a... Oh, he was a trip. <laughs> he was a good trip, though. Mm-hmm. I don't know if y'all know where Boaz is, Boaz, Alabama. They used to have the shopping malls over there. Well, Miss Janet would go over there every Thanksgiving, just about, and uh, get our overalls. And when she'd come back, she'd have a trip, truckload. The whole, her whole car would be trunk and everyone would be full. The SUV would be full. SUV would be full of, full of uh, overalls. Wendy Sue Hammond, how you doing? I like Miss Janet's hot pink pants. Yep. TJ Maxx special. Miss Janet said TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx. So anyway, we, um, he got back, she got back. Everybody around here that wore overalls to get all their new new overalls ready and put them on wearing boy everybody's looking sharp next day brand new overalls. You know. I never forget her daddy come around the corner and I look and everybody kinda of like looked at him and started kinda of laughing. He said, Boys, he said, I'm gonna tell y'all right now. He said, They don't have uh buckles no more. Uh, but they don't have buttons no more, they got zippers. Timmy K said, uh yes, north of uh US uh, says, oh, I don't, Mister. Where she go? Where she go? Oh, Tammy K said, uh, yes, north of us is Boaz, Alabama. If north of you, yeah. you must be in Sneed then. <laughs> you didn't think I know where Sneed is? What's that? Aniana. Aniana. We have friends living in Sneed, 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 More like our dad said. Mm -mm. No more buttons. Huh. Which I don't know how y'all did it with the buttons. I wouldn't wore them with the buttons. Oh, that was good. Yeah, but you had to button them up. They were what? Five buttons or something there? Mm-hmm. Well, that's what I did. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so good, but they're going to be excited when you get these zippers. Mm-hmm. It was a side, all right. <clears throat> Who said that? Tommy Sexton, what's up? Middle Mark. He said, hey, Miss Janet. Hey. Kelly Scott, what's the park? How you doing? My grandson lives in Boaz. Miss all them shops, yep. Yo, I got to go get a reload here. I got mine. You got yours? Mm -hmm. You like the little pork chop, come on. Mm-hmm. I'm going to leave my channel out to be cool a little bit. Oh, 
I'll hang on these taters to the looking at them. Got to get some of them taters. Peter hit me in the, bit me in top of the head. Y'all gonna run back and get my milk. You heard me? Yeah. Huh? Peter hit me in the back of the head. Uh-uh, girl. What you need milk for? Huh? What you need milk for? For me? To drink. Oh. You had a drink? No, I just didn't want to waste the milk. Mm. Who said that? I would hope that everybody protect your eyes tomorrow. When is that, y'all? Tomorrow. When tomorrow? Mm hmm. It's a big. A lot of it's going to happen around Kid Ron. Mm -hmm. Where Layman's is at. Mm -hmm. That's what Miss Hemi Tanner says. Mm hmm. She said he got a lot, a lot of people there. I mm. heard people at church going to Texas to see it. Mm -hmm. When I was a kid, we went to Florida and seen them. It was a total eclipse. And it got dark. Really? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm just been for my time. Hmm? Who said that? Uh, Howard Huggins, what's up? Oh yeah. Kelly uh, Falk said his grandma lives in uh, Boaz. Miss Old Shops, yep. Well, we had friends that actually lived in Sneed. And uh, we go over there and cut up. Mm -hmm. Mm, mm that's so good. One of our friends, mom lived over there in Boaz, uh, Sneed, and we would go over there and see him all the time. Yeah. Anyway, one time when um, the grandma we would go stay with and see all the time, she got sick. But she got dementia, Alzheimer's? Mm hmm something like that. Something like that. Anyway, she, uh, when they put her in the nursing home, she, uh, they was watching swamp people. And she was kind of going down, you know, with Alzheimer's and, uh, maybe other days. Anyway, she was going down with Alzheimer's and, uh, they, uh, she said, oh, look at there, that's old Bruce. Oh, Bruce on TV. He's been up in my house a many times, put his feet under my table a many times. <laughs> this makes you talk, too. And uh, all the uh, nurses and doctors and stuff was kind of laughing at her and stuff like that. And she, she kept on, they kept watching Swamp People, and every time she would say, Oh, that's Bruce. Uh, he done put his feet under my table a many times. So we, uh, about a week or two later, our friends went up there to see their mom and the doctors and the nurses pulled him inside and said, Hey, your mama thinks she knows that uh, Bruce Mitchell off of Swamp People. And uh, ran in them told him, Well, she does. <laughs> and uh, so they got a kick out of that. Mm -mm. Oh, it's good. I don't eat it. I'm going to take that pork chop from you. Hmm? Make it real slow, babe. You got three more over there. Okay, got two more over there. Donna Burke, how you doing, Miss Donna? She said, 
Mm -hmm. Gotta go good and wrap them all. Mm -hmm. you know? Oh yeah. You know that um the chicken you done and I have one left. I put it well yesterday when I made that lunch I made that pasta, little car pasta Alfredo. Uh -huh. I cut that up and put it in there. It was so good. With the mushrooms. And some cheese. Mm -hmm. Hey Miss Donna. How you doing? Donna Cohut? No. Uh, Earth. Earth. Mm -hmm. Earth. Uh, one time we were coming through, uh, through Tuscaloosa. Tuscaloosa. Mm. Up. <laughs> I want to say I was going to Michigan. We went up that way. We're going to hit 65 and go up that way. And, um, Anyway, behind Tuscaloosa got this little, I called it the shortcut road. The road went downhill all the way. Come out around Coleman, I think. But, uh, ooh, that was a bad road. The big truck, get, them cold, cold trucks get behind you and push you down the hill. Y'all, this is... Nothing but goodness. Mmm. Mmm. Cory Carter said you start to look like Santa Claus. <laughs> yep. We can get rid of it. You better hurry up too because you got you ain't got long for me. No Billy Peterson. I haven't seen Ron in a good little while. Um I called him every once in a while. We need to get together. Um, you said that last time we talked to him. Mm hmm. Everybody's always running. Mm hmm. The mosquitoes eat me up tonight. You? Mm hmm. Usually we boil all the crawfish this time of the year and um, eating lots and lots of garlic. <laughs> the crawfish don't, I mean, uh, the uh, mosquitoes don't bother me, but this year, oh my goodness. To Dana uh, Michaels, how you doing? Love watching you from where? Maryland. That's way up yonder. Who said that? Rick Davis, how you doing? Got a brother in law lives in Sneed, too. Ain't much there. I wasn't that, when I last yeah. time I went there. I don't know what they got now. Maybe. Mm hmm. Brother Chuck, how you doing? Have a great night. Oh, baby, it's 7.30 already. Yep. Hey, Miss Pat. Ricky Henderson, what, Bruce, you done? Great job with some pork chops. They good, too. I ain't lying. They good. Y'all need to try some of that. Billy Richards, how you doing? Good evening from Texas, Canada. I ain't been through that in a long time. Mm, mm, mm. She looks like Jana's sleeping. Look, I'm Jana's with that age. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Except a little more angel kiss on the chin. Marla uh, Carbarebra. Carbarebra. How you doing? First time watcher. How you doing? Welcome to the welcome to the page. Ain't no telling what you see on here. <laughs> Billy Richards uh, said he's late to the party. Yeah, I usually give out the merits, but uh, since Facebook's not. Sending out notifications, right? I'm not going to get nobody to demerits. Hmm. Sprig Hudson, what's up? Tell a good gator story. Hmm. Uh. That was funny or what? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
We have, we, we have some crazy gator stuff over the years. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Tell me the story. Tell me the story. I'm gonna tell them about me and your daddy one time. Okay. Me and uh, me and Harvey was in the pond, and uh, her daddy, Jen's daddy, and we'd go stand in the pond, the big gator pond. <coughs> Back then, they had 350 big gators in this pond. You know, so me and him would go stand in the pond and get the lilies out. We throw them up on the truck, and then they, um, we'd go feed them to the turtles. But I had a gate that kept messing with us. <laughs> and uh, the gator come back, and Howard said, next time the gator comes back, and the gator come back, and he spun around a couple of times. Of course, the gator was on the water. And all he seen was a little bit of his back. And Harvey had a pitchfork. Her daddy had a pitchfork. He said, I'm going to jug him a jugging with this pitchfork and he's going to take off watching. You know? Sure. He reached over and hit him with the pitchfork. Man, I'm, get me sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> you got, he reached over with that pitchfork and hit him and he thought the gator would take off. Gator run in between his legs. I'm talking about a 12 foot gator. Picked him up and he was laying on his back like this, going back and forth. And uh, I like to die laughing. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hey, I did do that accidentally. Mm -hmm. Trying to put it down and didn't do it. Another time, he started driving the backhoe, which he never did before. But he started driving that backhoe. And the backhoe has two brakes, the right brake and the left brake. Well... And they have a gas pedal, an accelerator pedal, and a lever you push it. Well, when you're traveling, you use the gas pedal. When you're uh, doing the backhoe part, you use the throttle. Well, he would use the throttle knob. Open it wide open and be going down the road. I said, Harvard, use the accelerator, use the pedal, the floor pedal. If something happens, you know, you, you're not going to be able to respond that fast. And he would use it, use it, give it all the gas. One day, Otaro, the uh, boys that worked for us, Otaro and his brothers were back there working on the pond. Well, they had the truck parked beside the pond, way beside the pond, and the door opened. Well, here come Harvey, getting it wide open through there with that with the uh, backhoe. And uh, he gets right there and he hits the brake. And when he does... He only hits one brake instead of both of them. If he hit one brake, one tire is going to grab and it's going to spin around. And you got that big bucket behind you. Well, when he did that, it spun around and that big bucket hit the door and tore it off. And then uh, he fussed and cussed and raised Cain. And uh, I think it was like three days later, the bars was back over there. The truck was missing the door. They had the truck turned around, parked in the same spot the other way. Well, here come Harvey. <laughs> Hits the brake and spun around and hit it. And Taro and them just started working. His brothers just started working for us. And they didn't speak a lot of English back then. And uh, anyway, Harvey got out. He said, crap, he knocked the other door off. So uh, he was ready to came fussing and cussing. And one of his favorite sayings, you ever seen any crap like that? So he said that. He said, y'all ever seen any crap like that? And one of them boys said, yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Mm -mm. He done some funny stuff now. We were at Kenyon the other day and somebody come by there. Somebody come by there and uh, brought us bluebell ice cream. You didn't tell me all that. Hmm? I did? No, you didn't. Mm. I'm going in and see if they eat my legs up. I'm coming back. Remind me to show you all the other stuff. Yes, ma'am. Bye, y'all. Maybe I'll pick up the phone over there. And that reminded me. Back in the day, we had big freezers, huge freezers up front, and you could drive a truck in. Hey, Wonder Williams, how you doing? Where you go? Took off again, you know. But one time we was uh, 
I went in and every, every morning, <coughs> first thing in the morning I'd check, I'd check all the freezers. Hey Gary Burke, how you doing? Ricky Henderson, what's up? Mm -hmm. Ricky Davis, check her Pete. Later, Miss Janet. She's pretty good and said, Good night, Janet. Hey, Miss Karen. Good night. Anyway, we come, I come in one morning, and um, her dad had went to Baton Rouge that night to pick up some stuff. We had several big freezers, and the first thing I'd done every morning when I got there, walk around and uh, check out the, uh, the, uh, the uh, freezers, you know, make sure everything was all right. And uh, anyway, I opened that door and it was bluebell ice cream stacked to the ceiling. I said, what in the world? I finally went inside and uh, what had happened was an 18 wheeler turned over and they told him to, your trucks, take what you want. We can't use it. Mm -mm. Diane Dixon, what's up? Dixon, Georgia. Is that Dixon? Dixie, uh, Dixon, uh, Dixon Union by Waycross? Who said that? Kathy, uh, Kate Gregory, how you doing? Have a blessed evening. Y'all too, and we're going to get out of here, and we're going to talk to y'all later. Y'all don't forget to like our page, and don't forget to share it. Of course, they got a slow connection. Rusty Warren, what's up? Thought they were complaining. Yeah, well, the other day, Kenyon's freezer went out. And, um, uh, hey, I've done my part trying to eat ice cream. We didn't want to waste it. I right, Miss Shirley Chuck. If you're getting off of here, I am too. Hi, right, good night, uh, everybody. We'll see y'all in the morning. We'll be cooking a little breakfast, hopefully. And uh, y'all don't forget to like our page and don't forget to share it. We out of here. Later.